In today's video, je vais te montrer comment cloner la tua voce en cualquier lengua. Es increíble lo que pueden hacer las tecnologías actuales for makers van inhoud op YouTube. Proste ni moje te te propusti. Hajo me masio. Have you ever had that dream of reaching the hearts and minds of the folks in, in Italy, in France, in Chile, uh, China, Japan? It's an exciting thought, isn't it? Well, today, my friend, I'm gonna show you that your dream is within your grasp. I'm sure you noticed the trend of popular YouTubers like Mr. Beast expanding their reach by translating their videos into multiple languages. And it's truly one of the best ways to grow as a creator and reach a wider audience. I'm gonna show you a mind-blowing tool that allows you to dub your videos in any language. Now, here's the catch. If you're only making videos in, let's say, English, you're limiting yourself to English-speaking viewers only. But guess what? Half of the world does not speak English. So there is a massive untapped market you are missing out on. So in this video, I'm super excited to show you how you can dub your videos in minutes to almost all of the most popular world's languages. But before we dive into details, let me introduce you to two amazing creators who have taken their content global. You might have heard about Mr. Beast, the king of YouTube, who has a lot of different channels in multiple languages. If you've only seen his English channel, you should definitely check out his channel in Espanol. This channel is generating millions of views and thousands of dollars to this blogger who's only dubbing and translating his videos. Another creator who's killing it in the game is Watch Mojo. They're a faceless channel with multiple videos on movies, stars, series, and gossip, with a whopping 25 mil subscribers. If you take a peek at their channel tab, you'll see that they also have channels in different languages. and. Look at how many subscribers they have. It's pretty amazing to see. Now, you might think that it's very expensive to do that. I'll show you how you can do the same thing for free or as low as one or two dollars a minute. So I'm gonna go to Dubformer AI platform and click try for free. And here, I don't like the cookies. I'm Anna, I'm typing my name, um, personal use, create account. As you can see, the interface is pretty simple and straightforward, um, very easy to use. And um, I can either drag and drop a file from my computer or paste a YouTube link. I'm gonna be using this file. I'm gonna be translating the short video. Um, it's only 20 seconds, don't worry. <laughs> so um, the um, source language is English. And the translation language, well, Let's make it Spanish. Uh, Spanish because I can verify the quality of translation. When it comes to voiceovers, there are three options. Um, you can replace the voice, um, you can place the voiceover over the original voice. I'm going to be choosing the smart voiceover options, which are supposed to keep all the background sounds. Um, I want to keep my music and replace only my voice with a translated voice. So I'm checking out um, because I have 15 free minutes, I don't have to pay, so I will have 14 minutes remained. And well, well, let's translate this short video. I've experimented with it a bit and the process is usually very quick. Um, it only takes several minutes. Um, in our case, it's three minutes while it's doing the translation. What we can do here, we can delete the video, archive the video, well, Overall, it's really, really simple, and that's what I love about it. There are so many online tools that are overloaded with features, so I really appreciate the simplicity. So the translation is complete, and as soon as it's completed, you can download it as an audio file, as a video file, as subtitles, um, so you really have a lot of choice here. But what I'm gonna do is I wanna make sure the translation is accurate. And to do that, I just go into this project and I can check the translation here. If I don't like a specific line or a specific word, I can just edit it like this. And it's gonna regenerate the audio file and the video file too. And then what I can do is I can change the speaker. Okay, I'm gonna press apply changes. 
And now let's see the original video and the translated video because I guess it's very interesting to see the differences and the accuracy of translation. Can you believe that Google Images was created because of one green dress? In the year 2000, Jennifer Lopez wore a green Versace jungle print dress to the Grammys. After her appearance, Google was flooded with queries about it. It caught the world's attention and people needed to learn more. At that time, that was the most popular search query ever input into the engine. All this led to the creation of Google Images. If you didn't know that, like and subscribe. Puedes creer que Google Imágenes se creó gracias a un vestido verde? En el año 2000, Jennifer Lopez usó un vestido verde con estampado de jungla en los Grammy. Después de su aparición, Google se vio inundado de consultas sobre cómo llamó la atención del mundo y la gente necesitaba saber más. En ese momento, esa era la búsqueda más popular que jamás puse en el motor. Todo esto llevó a la creación de Google Imágenes. Si no lo sabías, dale me gusta y suscríbete. Now let me tell you what I absolutely loved about this tool. First off, the automatic timestamp synchronization is a game changer. Whatever content you are creating, it's super important. With this feature, you can ensure everything is perfectly synced up, saving you time and effort. The simplicity of the interface is another thing that really impressed me. Seriously, it's so user-friendly, even a child could use it. I'm a big fan of tools that are powerful yet easy to use. Mastering a simple tool thoroughly feels a lot Lot more satisfying than picking up a super advanced, super complicated tool and using just a fraction of its features. Now here's what I guess really interesting. If you're running a faceless channel on YouTube or create educational courses or how-to videos, this tool is an absolute gem. While there may not be lip sync just yet, the translation accuracy is pretty spot on. Translating your videos into English can actually boost your income. The cost per click for English speaking audience tends to be higher. So you're basically, by adding videos in English, you're basically opening up a new avenues for revenue. And this means you can reach a wider audience with your content, regardless of language barriers. How cool is that? So make sure you'll check it out and I'll leave you guys the link in the description. If you if you enjoyed this tutorial, make sure you'll leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. I really hope it was useful. Thank you for watching and see you next week.